हेलो चिल्ड्रेन वेलकम टू द मैथमेटिक्स ब्रिज कोर्स क्लासेस फॉर लेवल थ्री दैट इज क्लासेस सिक्स सेवन एंड एट कंडक्टेड बाय समग्र शिक्षा सिद्धपेट माई सेल्फ किशोर कुमार गुंडवेनी पीजीटी मैथमेटिक्स फ्रॉम तेलंगाना मॉडल स्कूल मिर्दोगी सो चिल्ड्रेन टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू an important and interesting topic in mathematics that is construction of triangles so children let us straight away move into our topic look at the images shown on your screen can you identify the figures shown children yes they are triangles and children do you know what a triangle is yes a triangle is a simple closed figure with three sides and three angles and children do you know how many independent measurements are needed to construct a triangle yes you are absolutely right you need three independent measurements to draw a triangle now let us see what are those three independent measurements a triangle can be drawn if you know the elements that are required for two triangles to be congruent that means you need to know the congruency of triangles criteria let us see the first one children that is three sides of a triangle s s s criterion that means if you know three sides of a triangle then you can construct a triangle the second one is two sides and included angle between them that is s a s criterion so if you know two sides and the included angle then also you can construct a triangle the third one is two angles and the side included between them that is asa congruency criterion and finally we have hypotenuse and one adjacent side of a right angled triangle that is rhs congruency criterion if you know any one of these criterion that is if you know three sides of a triangle or two sides and included angle or two angles and an included side or a right angle hypotenuse and any one side of the triangle then you can construct a triangle and children it's very important to note that you can construct even a triangle when two sides and non included angle is also given got it children children let us start our first construction that is construction of a triangle when measurements of the three sides are given so for that we'll take the first example that is construct a triangle abc with sides ab equal to 4.5 cm bc equal to 5 cm and ca equal to 6.5 cm let's start the construction so first you need to draw a rough figure before actual construction so this is compulsory for all the constructions okay children first let us draw a line segment ab of length 4.5 cm as shown now with the help of the compass and scale mark a length of 5 cm with b as center and radius bc equal to 5 cm let us draw an arc as shown on your screen again mark a length of 6.5 cm because ca equal to 6.5 cm with the help of the compass and scale with a as center and radius 6.5 cm draw an arc such that it intersect the previous arc mark the point of intersection as c now join points b and c and also a and c here abc is the required triangle children let us move to our next construction of triangle when two sides and included angle are given let us take the example construct triangle abc with ab equal to 4 cm bc equal to 
5 centimeters and angle B is equal to 50 degrees. Let us start with the construction. So I already told you, you need to draw a rough figure children. Okay. So I am starting with the fair construction. Okay, children. So first, let us draw a line segment AB of length 4 centimeters using a scale. Now, given angle B is equal to 50 degrees. Now, place the protractor exact at point B. Okay, children, the horizontal line and the point should coincide with B and mark 50 degrees as shown. Now, we are going to draw a ray through point B. You can see on the screen. So, this ray makes an angle of 50 degrees. Now, the third measurement is given as 5 centimeters, that is B C equal to 5 centimeters. Now, with B R center and radius 5 centimeters, draw an arc so that intersects the ray at point C. Now, join point C and A. So, yes, A B C is the required triangle. Children, let us move to our next construction. Construction of a triangle when two angles and included side is given to us. So let us take the example here. So construct triangle MAN with MA equal to 5 centimeters, angle MA equal to 40 degrees, angle A is equal to 100 degrees. So first, let us draw a line segment MA whose length is 5 centimeters. Next, take with MR center, draw a ray making an angle of 40 degrees. Now using a scale, let us join this point M. So this is the ray we have obtained. So let it be MX. Now let us mark the other angle at A which is 100 degrees. So using the protractor again we have marked 100 degrees and uh, take a scale and with from A draw a ray such that it will intersect the previous ray at some point say M. Now, MAN is the required triangle. Children, let us move to our next construction. Construction of right angled triangle when the hypotenuse and the side are given. Let us take an example here. So, construct triangle ABC, right angled at A with BC equal to 6 centimeters and AB equal to 5 centimeters. So, let us start the construction. So first we are going to draw a line segment AB of length 5 centimeters. So next take a compass and we are going to draw a right angle at point A. So you can see we are going to draw a right angle as shown on your screen first marking 60 degrees then 120 and we are bisecting the angle between 60 and 120 degrees. Oh, now we are going to join point A with the point of intersection of R. So this is our right angle. Now to locate the third vertex, now take BC equal to 6 centimeters as shown using a compass and scale. Now with B as center, and radius equal to 6 centimeters. We are going to draw an arc on the ray AX as shown. Now join points B and the point of intersection of the arc and the ray and mark the point as C. Now ABC is the required right triangle, right angle that A. 
children complete the following problems that are shown on your screen as an assignment and show to your subject teacher 